Hi, this is Dr. Vijay. In this video, I am going to talk about enzyme inhibition. This is an introductory video about enzyme inhibition. As the name suggests, the enzyme inhibition means a molecule or compound which binds to an enzyme thereby it decreases activity of enzyme or tend to decrease the rate of reaction by altering either KM or Vmax or both so they decrease enzyme activity so these molecules or compounds are called inhibitors and this binding could be reversible binding or irreversible binding so these inhibitors so they are present in our body that is they could be natural like in our metabolic pathways so once a product is formed it can inhibit rate limiting enzymes of that particular pathway so that means the enzyme inhibition also present in our body as a natural inhibitors or it could be synthetic so the synthetic inhibitors are of great help especially in treating many disorders so they could be used as drugs for treating gout cancer hypertension infection so these enzyme inhibitors can be used as antibiotics even antidepressant these enzyme inhibitors have a great clinical significance for treating the many types of disease so we will study the classification of enzyme inhibition as i mentioned beginning the binding of inhibitors to the enzyme might be reversible or irreversible so based on this enzyme inhibitors broadly classified into two types reversible inhibitors so here the binding of inhibitors to the enzyme is not tight or it is not by covalent bonds usually by non covalent bonds the another category of enzyme inhibitors is irreversible inhibitors so here the binding is very tight the inhibitor binding to the enzyme is covalently binding again the reversible inhibitors are subclassified into three types competitive inhibitors non competitive inhibitors and the third category is uncompetitive inhibitors so these are the three categories competitive inhibition non competitive inhibition and uncompetitive inhibition under reversible inhibitors they are also three types the first type of irreversible inhibitors group specific they react only to certain groups the second type is reactive substrate analogs they are just like competitive inhibitors but they are irreversible inhibitors they are also called affinity labels they are reactive substrate analogs analogs means they are structurally similar to the substrate just like competitive inhibition the last category of irreversible inhibition or inhibitors is suicide inhibition it is a mechanism based inhibition so you need to remember the enzyme inhibitors are broadly classified into two types reversible inhibitors and irreversible inhibitors again the reversible inhibitors are competitive non competitive and uncompetitive and the irreversible inhibitors are group specific inhibitors reactive substrate analogs or affinity labels and mechanism based inhibitors or suicide inhibitors so i am going to talk about this individual category inhibition in future videos this is the brief introductory video about 
enzyme inhibition thanks for watching